Hey babes, I found some old videos from when I was in Rome last year, so enjoy! We started off strong with like zero hours of sleep when the time and space travel machine <laughs> dropped us off at our destination. On the first day, we mostly just walk around to get a first impression. And also, it was so hot during our stay, but luckily you will always find those little fountains in Rome. The gelato from this gelateria we got recommended from our hotel receptionist and after that we went there almost daily. The next day, we were ready to explore the city a little more. <laughs> of course we had a little pit stop in between We came across this beautiful church, but unfortunately I forgot the name. And as I said, it was very hot. So luckily we could take a look at this air-conditioned free art gallery and it was very cool. This spot to this day remains one of my favorite places. Get ready with me. Well, kind of. We're going to the Vatican.
just a little disclaimer, if you go to Rome in August, it may be that crowded in real life. I think with this clip I captured how my espresso addiction started. And we're back again. We would always ask the ice cream sellers which flavors to get and I've never had rice ice before but let me tell you it was so good. Side fact, but there were a total of two proposals while we were at the Trevi Fountain. And at night, when there were less people, this also was one of my favorite places. I could have sat there for hours listening to the water and see the reflection of the light. There's also this tradition where you throw a coin over your back in the fountain and then a wish will come true. number
of course, we had to go thrifting. And that was actually our last day in Rome. Trust me, the unfancy looking one tastes better. It was a wonderful time.